Biblically-Centered Kids! Well, happy Wednesday, kiddos! Thank you so much for listening to the Biblically-Centered Kids podcast. I'm so happy that you're here today. It's a great Wednesday, August 14th, 2024. My name is Miss Danica. Today, we've got a pretty fun national holiday. Today is World Lizard Day. How many of you out there like lizards? Oh yeah, they're pretty cool, huh? Well, lizards have a huge array of species, including geckos, chameleons, iguanas, and skinks. Over 5,000 species, in fact. Reptiles are air-breathing vertebrates covered in scales, plates of bone, or a combination of both. These animals shed their skin and depend on the environment to regulate their body temperature. This means that they have to find sun and shade in order to warm up or cool down. Do you like lizards? With so many animals under the lizard umbrella, I've got five facts for you about these fun creatures. Fact number one, not all lizards have legs. Yep, that's right. Some lizards are legless. Though they may resemble snakes, there are a few differences between them. Lizards have tiny ear holes, while snakes don't, and their tails make up most of their body, while snakes have much shorter tails. Who knew? All right, here's our fun fact number two. Komodo dragons are the king of the lizards. That means that they're the largest and heaviest of all lizards. They can reach about 10 feet long and weigh over 150 pounds. They have a venomous bite and can take down much larger mammals, including buffalo and deer. Whoa. All right, fact number three. We just talked about the king of the dragons. Now, what about the tiniest? The tiniest known reptile is a nano chameleon. Nano chameleon. Whose nickname is the bee nana. Yep, that's right. The bee nana lives in northern Madagascar and is no bigger than a sunflower seed. Their entire body can fit on the tip of your finger. How cute! All right, number four. While a lot of lizards are silent, some of them actually make noise. Geckos, for example, can chirp, click, and squeak. The gila monster and blue tongue skink hiss to deter potential predators. And the toucan gecko earned its name from the toucan, toucan sound that it makes. All right, and here's our fact number five, our last one. Some lizards can actually breathe underwater. Yep, six species of lizards can blow out large bubbles filled with oxygen that stick to their heads. They inflate these bubbles and then draw the oxygen back into their noses, allowing them to stay underwater for extended periods of time. Whoa, that's kind of crazy. All right. Well, I hope that you enjoyed those fun facts about lizards for World Lizard Day. And now it's time to get on to our game. But first, you know, we always got to review it. What's this week's virtue? That's right, it is wisdom. Virtue G says we gain wisdom by asking God for instruction on what is right. And speaking of wisdom, welcome to the Odd One Out. In this game, I'll give you a list of four items and your job is to figure out which one doesn't belong to the others. The Odd One Out could be different because of its category, color, type, or something else. Are you ready to test your brain power and wisdom? Here's odd one out. All right, number one. I've got for you an apple, banana, a carrot, and a grape. Which one is the odd one out? Yep, it's the carrot, of course. That's a vegetable. The others were all fruit. All right, here's our next one. Dog, cat, cow, eagle. Of course, you knew that one again, too. It is the eagle. The eagle is a bird and our others were mammals. All right, next. Winter, spring, 
Saturday fall. Of course, it's Saturday. That is a day of the week while the others were seasons. And speaking of seasons, we said winter, spring, and fall. Which one are we missing? Yep, that's right. Summer, which is what we're currently in. All right, here's our next odd one out. Football, basketball, tennis, or soccer. And I know some of you out there, football and soccer are the same thing for you. But over here in America, they're different. So what's the odd one out between all four of those? Yep, the odd one out is tennis. In that sport, you use a racket to hit the ball instead of using your hands or your feet. All right, here's our next one. Carrot, tomato, potato, or cucumber? A little bit of a tricky one. Odd one out is the tomato. The tomato is actually a fruit while the other ones are vegetables. However, you know wisdom. Wisdom means we are not going to stick that tomato in a fruit salad. All right, here's our next odd one out. Red, blue, yellow, or green? Hmm, what do those have in common? Well, Red, blue, and yellow are primary colors, so that makes green our odd one out. How do you make green? You make green with yellow and blue. All the other colors, those primary colors, red, yellow, and blue, are only made up of themselves. All right, here's our next odd one out. Lion, tiger, bear, or penguin? Yep, just like before, it's gonna be that bird. That penguin is a bird and the other ones were mammals. All right, here's our next one. Sunflower, rose, maple, daisy. Hmm, was this one tricky? It is actually the maple that is a type of tree while the others are flowers. All right, here's our next odd one out. Apple. Pear, orange, broccoli. I'm sure you knew this one. Of course, it's broccoli. That vegetable sneaking in there with all those other fruits. All right. Here's maybe a tricky odd one out for you. Are you ready? Mount Everest, Mount Fuji, Mount Denali, Mount Kilimanjaro. Ooh. Okay, these are all mountains. The odd one out is Mount Denali. That one is in North America over here on our hemisphere. The other three, two of those are in Asia while one is in Africa. So they're on the other half of the globe. All right, here's another odd one out. Piano. Guitar. Flute. Or drums. What did you think? Well, I thought flute. You use your mouth to make music with a flute while all the other instruments use your hands. All right, here's another sport one for you. Soccer, ice skating, golf, or basketball. Well, the odd one out, if you've been watching the Olympics or if you've been playing any sports this summer, the odd one out, of course, is ice skating. That is a winter sport, while the others are more non-winter. All right, just two more left. Are you ready? Parrot, pigeon, bat, sparrow. Yes, well, the odd one out here, even though it does fly, is the bat. Bats are actually mammals, while the others are birds. All right, and our last one for today, a rose, tulip, oak, or lily. Yep, that odd one out is our oak. That is a tree, and the others are flowers. Well, great job, everyone. You've all done an amazing job figuring out the odd one out. Remember, it's always fun to think critically and notice the details that make each thing unique. Thanks for playing Odd One Out. Keep those brains sharp and ready for more challenges. Until next time.